to there we go this is the brooklyn studio candle in love potion i am obsessed with this i've had it for about a few months now and look i i light it about every night and look how much candle i have left it smells so so good and it's amazing because they even tell you all the different notes of the candle so it's not just like love potion and then you kind of have to figure out what's in there um, it's a little bit more luxurious than a Bath and Body Works candle. Definitely makes me feel um, a little bit more adult. Um, so if you're like me and want to step up and away from all that stuff, highly recommend looking into Brooklyn Candle Studio. Their stuff is so good. Um, but Love Potion has a few different um, notes. And in the top, we have Mandarin. So we get like that citrusy type of smell in the middle is lavender so it's more calming and you can really smell all of those things and then in the base is jasmine blossom which just smells so divine all of those things together smell so good it's poss possibly my favorite scent honestly it should be made into a perfume or something um because i would wear it and honestly i like this every single day Oh my gosh, I didn't even realize that it had a little angel number right here. If you guys don't know, I'm really into crystals, angel numbers, spirituality, all of those things. Um, and it actually says 222 right here, which is crazy because that's the number I've been seeing. Um, and it means to not worry. So to all of us, let's not worry anymore. Don't overthink things. Um, which is amazing. Okay, that makes me so happy. <laughs> um, anyway, that's I'd never seen that. Anyway, it smells really, really good. I'm obsessed with the smell. The burn time is kind of ridiculous. I had it burning for about six hours yesterday, and still I have most of my candle. Um, I've had this for about a month already, so think about me lighting it just yesterday as opposed to almost a few times a week, I want to say. I wouldn't really say every day, but definitely a few times a week, I am lighting this candle for a long period of time. And look how much I still have. Like, this candle is really going to make it last, and it doesn't hold that much space. It's not that distracting. And once you're done with this jar, you can use it for a multitude of different things. You can clean out the jar, which there's a few ways to do, um, like boiling water, and pouring the water into the jar to get all the wax out. You could also freeze it, I believe. There's a few different things that you could do to get the wax out of here, but I'm probably gonna remove the wax and then reuse this to hold Q-tips, maybe paper clips, um, just things around the house that need something to hold them in, and that isn't a cardboard box or anything like that. Um, I prefer using, um, reusing things around my house. Um, like I said, sustainable practices, reusing things around my house to store other things or to just function better in different ways. So that's a little DIY for you guys to clean out this candle and then have it forever to use to use and hold a bunch of different things. I would even make a cake in a jar. You could always, if you have kids or nieces and nephews, it is so fun to make cakes in a jar. And I usually will use um, these type of um, jars for them, obviously with the wax removed. Um, but these jars can handle a lot of different things. Um, it is a glass jar. So it is like a reusable mason jar essentially. So that is just one of the many ways that I am going to continue loving this candle after its life cycle is over, um, which is amazing. I want to be doing that with everything. So seriously, get yourself your hands on this candle because it smells so good. And then you can reuse the jar later. Um, and it also will last you forever. Like this is a scent that I'm probably never going to um, forget and I'm always going to want to have around. So I'm very happy that this, that there's so much product in here that it's going to last me. Um, so yes, I love that candle, but let's keep it going. We're going to have a little different vibe going on. 